Having telekinesis does not make you invincible. But it guarantees victory against you. I suppose you met the great Kung Lao too. No. He was before my time. You're not the most convincing thug. <laughs> Don't lie, Kung Lao. You were spooked. <laughs> Do me a favor. When you fight Katana, beat her. <laughs> 
Losing stings, doesn't it? Isn't this better than working in the fields? This life does have its advantages. <laughs> Find your island, Shang Tsung. <laughs> I sincerely hope you do. As a child, was your mind this diseased? I object to your description, Kung Lao.
It was inevitable that the Shaolin masters had me join them. They knew just how much future initiates could learn from me. Shujinko was one of my earliest. His ability to absorb anyone's powers and skills was amazing. With the right training, he could become our greatest champion. I knew that I alone could give it to him. But as his proficiency grew, so did his ego. In love with himself and his power, Shujinko became a threat to the realms. He hadn't learned humility because I wasn't the one who could teach it. I should have listened to Raiden's warning and not tried to train Shujinko alone. After he was subdued, Shujinko's accumulated abilities and memories were taken from him. He is once again a new initiate, ready to begin his training. This time, Raiden and I train Shujinko together. He will become the champion he is destined to be. And I will fulfill my duties, humbly and cooperatively.